everybody. Wade Steinloggy here with uh, Coach Rafael Martinez of the men's soccer program. Uh, Coach, appreciate uh, taking a little bit of your time on a Monday afternoon. I'm sure you're plenty busy. Yes, <laughs> yes. Preparing for two games this week. So um, let's uh, hit on last week real mm -hmm. quick and then turn the page to, to this week. But um, Avila came in um, and they, they had a pretty good offense right out the gate and we just couldn't recover. Uh, play a lot better in the, the final 60 minutes or so. But um, if you want to just hit on a couple points from last week. Uh, yeah, Evola, like you said, they started early, and they continued it for, for 90 minutes, and credit them, they put together a, a very solid performance uh, defensively and attacking-wise. I mean, the two goals that we scored were, were top-quality goals. Right. Besides that, we really didn't create many chances. So um, overall, it was just a game we, we learned from. Mm -hmm. uh, we definitely looked at it and saw that we need to make some changes, maybe personnel-wise. Sure. And the way that we played, because obviously losing three games in a row, something needs to change. Right, so right. Uh, we reevaluated some things, and uh, we've, we've made some changes that hopefully are going to help us moving forward. Sure. Okay, talking about moving forward. Um, Graceland uh, tomorrow night at home, and then you have uh, Mid-America Nazarene on Saturday on the road. A um, couple of hack teams, teams that we'll be playing in the future um, a whole lot. You know, what are you seeing from these teams as you obviously are looking forward to, you know, the transition for next year, but you know, what are you what are you seeing out of the fourteen versions of these teams? Um, it's gonna be two very good sides. I mean, mm -hmm. both teams uh went to the national tournament last year, so um it's it's gonna be tough competition, but it's gonna be competition that's gonna prepare us for, right. for conference. So these two games are are going to be difficult, and we're going to have to play nearly perfect games to, to get results. But um, And I think the guys understand that. So we're going uh, into tomorrow optimistic and understand that we have to play a very, very good game if we right. want to beat a very good Graceland team. And although their record may not show it, right. they are a very good team. Yeah. Uh, we had the opportunity to watch them play against Grandview, and, and they showed that there's a reason why they went to the national tournament. Sure. So, you know, tomorrow... Looking forward to it to to see you know where we want to be next year and and the type of recruiting that we have to do mm -hmm. and uh, you know they're just building blocks to get us ready for conference. So sure. yeah, all of these games we want to go out and win, but at the end of the day we want to improve and get better and be prepared as much as we can for that first conference game. Um, speaking of the improvement side, what are you guys trying to do right now? If you don't mind lending your hand a little bit, um, but. You know, what, what are you trying to improve on to get better to you know get back to that four game winning streak right. mentality and I think a lot of the focus in the beginning of the season was focused on our just our back four and our goalkeeper mm -hmm. working together defensively but I think now we're we're learning that it's got to be an entire team yeah. working as one defending so um, and the way we've been playing lately we, we've been giving up too many chances and and we really haven't been creating a lot so right. Uh, we've left ourselves open to, we've left ourselves susceptible to for other teams to create a lot of chances and to really be able to manage us pretty easily defensively. So what we're going to try and do is maybe change the way we play a little bit and just maybe be a little bit more compact defensively and make sure if teams are going to break us down, try and make it as hard as we can. Right. So um, defensively, we've we've made some improvements in that and working on certain things like that this week in practice in preparation for the game. So. You know, every training session we tell the guys we're just looking to get better. Sure. When you're out here, get better, work on an aspect of your game that you think you need to improve on. So hopefully in the in this week before we play Grandview, we make some uh, some big improvements so that we can, you know, put ourselves in a in a opportunity to compete as much as we can in the, in the MCC. Right, definitely. Um, homecoming week, unfortunately, won't be here for the, the end of homecoming week, but hopefully there'll be some... Uh, some alum that might be able to make it up for tomorrow night's uh, game, hopefully. That would be great and for them to uh, you guys put on a, a good show against Grace on some best of luck, Coach. Thank you. Appreciate it, and uh, good luck to the football team this weekend and homecoming. All right. Thanks, Rob. Thanks.